on my last video, you kind of get the impression that I don't really like the game. And at the end of the video, I didn't even recommend it. But I'd like to take that back. I'd like to retract that from the record. I do recommend this game, and it's still got a few problems here and there, but it has been massively improved, and it is a ton of fun. Right now, I'm in the dead of winter, so let's go do some snow trucking. And we are in. I spent a lovely night at this roadside motel. This is my truck. She's a beast. It's a class three. It's been mildly modded. I haven't changed the light bar or the exhaust because it still reappears over itself after you save and quit. And that bugs me, but it's all right. So I just have that like that, but I got a nice bowl bar. I got my cover on because it's really, really freaking cold. And yeah, she got a top speed of 65. I go places fast. Let's get her fired up. Ah, my windows have frozen. All right. Let's start the truck. Very nice. Get it warming up. Now, I need to find a job. What looks fun? Now, I don't really look for money when looking for a job. I look for experience. Ooh, 287. That's the biggest one so far. Yep, and that is the biggest one. So we're going to take that. Let me fix my windshield and we will be on our way. Scrape, be scrape, be scrape, be scrape. And she's golden. All right, and and break off. Let's go get this load. And I've crashed. Straight into a pole. That's my bad. Damn it, did I hurt my tail or headlight? I don't even know how I did that. Right into the pole. Yes, I did hurt my headlight. Let me fix that real quick. And fixed. All right, headlight is good. This headlight is good. Now we can begin. It's currently 4.46 in the morning. It's a chilly 11.1 .1 degrees Fahrenheit. And I don't know what that is in Celsius because I'm an American, damn it. All right, we are here. Parking break. I should turn my heater on. It is a little chilly out. You good, sir. Give me a job. That one right there. 1,035 miles. Got a day to get there. Let's do it. Getting out of here might be a bit tricky. Nah, that's not that tight. I thought it was tighter than that. And that is perfect. All right, hook up the trailer. Lock it. Raise the landing gear. Boom, and the cables. Electricity. In the air. That's done. We can go. Yeah, look at that. Nothing but a thing. There's a motorcycle out on the road. Look at that. Now the uh, uh, driving physics in the snow. I'm not sure. You do have a lot of grip considering that it's snow and ice. Like I'm going 35, right? And then I slam on my brakes and I slow down pretty much as fast as I would on the pavement. I don't think I'd slow down that real life in the snow and the ice. I don't think I'd slow down that fast in real life in the snow and the ice. I don't know, that's just me. All right, now we are on the open road and my window looks to be freezing over a little bit. It's starting to get blurry already. Even though it's now 11.2 degrees, it's warming up. Look, like just, 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 I'm going 40 miles an hour around this turn, turning sharp. I mean, I just go around it. I don't understeer, I don't oversteer, I don't, I just steer through the corner. And I don't know, I have the best tires on and chains, but still, in real life, if I was to turn that sharply on the snow, my front tires would still understeer. They still would. But we're not going to get bogged down in this video about stuff that bugs me. We're going to have some fun. Are there any points of interest that I have not hit? There's a couple right there. I want to stop and see what those are. Road trip after all, right? I can't get it to actually give me a route there. If I set... Oh, right there. Well, that's close enough. I can find it from there. Yeah, as soon as we started and my window is frozen again, it's starting to get blurry. I can't see. I'm going to have to fix that. I've only got 2% remaining on my winter coat. That's not good. Do I have another one? Did I buy another one? Not in there. 
And it's not in there. No, I do not have another coat. We should have stopped at a store of some kind. In fact, I'm going to stop at a store down here by this point of interest. If there is a store down... Yeah, this is a town. It'll have a store. Where's the store hidden? Right there. And stop at this store and hope that they have a jacket of some kind. Scrape, scrape. Mind the windshield wipers. You get a lot of XP for that in uh, the winter. You get a lot of XP in the winter for that because you got to do it so much. That is a nice way to get level up your mechanical skill. Do I have any level ups? I, well, I got one right here, but I don't know. I want this one. I'm saving that up. Yeah, I got nothing. Well, I can almost afford expanded tire storage space. I am 99 points away. And away we go. Oh, I was going to say, damn, we only got 480 miles left, but I forgot that I reset it to the store. I was like, damn, we made good time. But no. 64 miles an hour over a thick sheet of ice. That's how you go trucking. And it's up to 11.5 degrees. I might not even need a jacket. I'm hauling a, a, a explosive liquid, you see. And I'm next to a pipeline full of uh, explosive liquid. Should I crash into it and cause a massive explosion? No, I won't. I won't. I won't. Let's not do that. I really shouldn't be driving this quickly with low visibility in case there's an avalanche and then I won't have time to stop and then I'll crash and it will just be horrendously awful. Matter of fact, what I'm gonna do, because I forgot to back there, is I'm gonna save the game. I got two of them. I'm gonna save it right here and then I'll save it a little bit later on. Just in case. I do like the trailer will, will slide around a little bit on you there. You start going back and forth, it'll kind of get a tank slapper going on. I do enjoy that. And now nothing has actually spawned in and I can't tell where the road is. Oh, there we go. The world's coming back. There we go. I'm just driving too fast for the game to keep up. It's like, please wait. We are now 327 miles from the store. And my jacket, ooh, my jacket has 0% remaining. It is done. Although my little jacket symbol's still on, so that's good. What I like that this game did with the snow is, right now it's snowing, and it's a little dark, but um, you turn your headlights on, and all you can see is the glare on the snow. And you turn your brights on, and it just makes it worse. That's realistic. You don't drive in like fog or heavy snow with your bright lights on. I like that. Also, I, I'm on a big hill and I'm not paying attention. There we go, up and over the hill. And again, my window is freezing. I'm gonna go a little bit longer and, and then I'll do it when it's really bad. That's the safe way. Okay, that is actually quite bad now. I'm gonna fix it. Uh-oh, my jacket's completely gone now. Now I am cold. I don't know why I'm complaining, it's 13.8 degrees. All right. Now that should have leveled me up enough. It did. I can afford Tire Workshop 2 or I can save it and reduce repair costs, repairs of suspension and advanced subsystems or more customization. You know what? I'm gonna save it for now. Yes, I know, I'm that boring guy. That's not the gear shift button, that's the brake button. There we go. Oh, now it's 2.6 degrees. Damn, that dropped fast. Oh, a bit of a sharp corner. Woo, ain't nothing but a thing, though. In the last update, they massively improved the playing with the controller. Like, going through a corner, you used to have to, like... Hold on, let me get to a corner and I'll show you. You'd have to, like, do this little dance with the wheel and just eat, eat, eat. And it was very fast and twitchy and touchy. And now you can just kind of go around the corner in a smooth fashion. It's much nicer. I forgot that I have traffic turned off because I hate it. I'll turn it on for the video for something to do. Hello, sir. And this is why I have the traffic off. Okay, well, the speed limit is 25. And it just barely got to it, so he was slowing down for the speed limit. I respect that. But 
I still hate the traffic and I just like to have the road all to myself. Okay, now it's 55. You best get a move on or I'll blow your doors off. Choose! No! Are you allowed to pass on a bridge? Because I'm about to pass on a bridge. Nerd! Now, in fairness, they are the ones that are driving like they should be, you know. In the snow, you don't go down the road at 55 if it's not safe. They are the ones being cautious. I'm not. But still, they're nerds! Man, this has taken a hot second to get to this store. And I'm still 130 miles away. And that's not even the end of the journey. That was like half of it, maybe. All right, it says I am 95 miles away. And in 100 miles, I go straight. So, the destination is closer than my next instruction. That doesn't make sense. My window's frozen again, but I'm gonna just keep going because we are almost there. Hello, fellow truck driver. I must pass you at speed. All right, we are coming up on Fairbanks. I think there's a cement truck in front of me, but I can't tell because of how icy my window is. And shut up, my voice did not just break. Oh, the light just went green. Yay for me. Where's the damn entrance? It's over there. Oh, it's over there. Oh, and there's someone behind me. We're gonna have to go around the block. All right, we are going around the block so that we can actually get in to the store. And I can't see shit, can you? I hope that's an opening, because I'm going for it. And don't mind me, I'm just gonna park right here. I will only be a minute. All right. Let's go get me a jacket. Let's hope they have a jacket. Yes, I see clothes. I want something big and heavy. I'm gonna go for the parka coat. Yes. And then my winter coat, which is dead, I'm gonna just drop. Hold to unequip. Drop it. And it just disappears. Good. Put my new coat on. All right. I am warm. Scrape, scrape, scrape. Nice and clean. All right, now we gotta get out of here without hitting anything or anyone. I'm just gonna back out. Nah, screw it. I'm gonna save uh, points of interest for another video. I'm just gonna go there. The lights are being kind to me today. Let's see if this one will. Was it gonna change for me or am I gonna have to stop? Change, change, change. Yes, yes. Victory is sweet. Uh-oh, this one's green. It's gonna change on me, isn't it? Oh, damn, it is. Oh, I thought I'd make it through all the lights, but I didn't. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Ooh, now we're on a highway. Oi, 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 oi. Pull out in front of me much. Well, I guess I was in the outside lane and he pulled into the inside lane. No, I'm on the inside lane and he pulled into the outside lane, so he didn't really get in my way. But still, slow down for the roadworks that is spawning in as I speak. The game has suddenly started to run very poorly for some reason. My CPU is spiking at 100% and holding and is very warm. What I'm going to do now is restart the game and come back. And we are back. Everything seems to be in order. Nothing is maxing out again. And we're good to go. And we're off. How did I cause an accident? How did I cause an accident? That truck was behind me, but I pulled away from him. It's not like I backed into him. And are you stuck, buddy? You are in the way. Get out of the way. Oh my god, it's a good thing this game doesn't let you carry a gun. Oh great, now I'm stuck on the guardrail. Watch out, pickup. I didn't hit anything. That trailer did not hit that truck. Get out of the way, moron. Jeez. Whoa, hey. 
what is it with you people and obeying the speed limit? It gets old. 350 miles away from our target and things are going good. Warmed up to 13.9, so that's nice. And you know what? I don't know why. I got a feeling, I got a feeling that I should save right here. I don't know why. Something's telling me to. So it has been saved and we can move on. Uh-oh, uh-oh, there's an avalanche. Dude, dude, the road's not clear. Dude, dude, oh my God, he just went up and over it. Wow, that was impressive. I probably can't do that. I'm not even gonna try, I'm just gonna go around. Just for God's sakes, do not fall in the lake. Look at this guy. Whoa! Is that how you do it in Alaska? I couldn't find the camera. Is that how you do it in Alaska? Like, if there's an avalanche, you just like frick it and go on your way. It don't matter. Mother Nature can't tame me. Cause that is bitching. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lock the diffs just for that extra little bit of grip. All right, all right, here we go. Whoa, please. Please make it. And I think I made it. There's a truck coming. I want to see what it does. And here he comes. And he, he too, is just, wah. Dude, you didn't even lose nothing. Well done, you. I should have turned the traffic on a long time ago. That's quite fun to watch. Let's hope there are no more avalanches on the way. Is that how you pronounce it? Avalanche? I think so. Look, this is that dump truck that went over the Avalon. Dude, that was so cool. I should get on the CB and tell him what a rock star he is. And then I should get on the CB and tell him to get out of the way. You go over an avalanche like it's nothing, but then you go about three miles an hour. Scoozy. Oh my God, he slammed on his brakes. Okay, that was my bad. I was falling too close and he uh, slammed on his brakes. Good old brake check from him. That, I'll take the blame for that one following too close. Also, I'm an eighth trying to come from a stop and that's not working out for me. Easy round the sharp curve. Squeeze the power through the long banked curve. Oh, now the speed limit's 15. Oh, now it's 15. Oh, joy. But look, he's going 23, 24. He ain't going no 15. What? Well, if he can speed, then I can speed, and I'm going to speed. And then when the cop pulls me over, I'll say, well, he was doing it, so why can't I? And then the cop will say, and if he had a friend named Cliff, would you throw him off a jump? What? Oh, big ol' hill, come on. There you go. 606 of the finest Alaskan horses under my hood. And I don't know how many torque, it doesn't tell you that. I wish it did, that'd be nice to know. Because horsepower is all well and good. But I want to know what my torque is. I must pass you now, but uh, see the speed limit through this part of the world is 55, and we just went through like road work, and I don't think that should be 55 through there. It doesn't make sense. I don't know. I'm not here to judge. I'm here to drunk. Oh my God! Let's get a move on, people. Oh, he's trying to race me. Oh, he's trying to race me. It's on now, and I'm in the lead. I'm winning. Suck on that. Ooh, we're only 140 miles away. We make, and there's a cop that sits right here. I know that for a fact. I'm gonna slow down. Yeah, there he is. Just waiting. And there's another one down the end of this road too. So I'm gonna continue to be very careful. Oh, I am tired. Got 130 miles left, 13 hours. Oh hell, I have time for a little nap. Let's uh, stop right here. I like this spot. Turn my wipers off, keep my heater on. And we'll grab a few Z's for, let's say, three hours. Yeah. I love how he lays down and then gets back up. He's literally laying down like this. Oh, that's got to kill your neck, man. It is now 640. And it is beginning to go dark. Temperature is 1.9 degrees. All is well. Oh, I forgot about the cop up here. I better slow down. Right there. In the nick of time. Now look, this is like a town. And 
Speed limit's 25. I can accept that. That makes sense. You go slower through the town. Excuse me, dear sir. But thou fricketh off. And you. And also you. And that is a bitchin' purple truck. I like that color. Well done. Look at this. Look at this bit of the map. I do not understand this bit. Watch the speed limit. Okay, it's 55. And then it goes 25, 55, 25, 55, 25, and 55. That just makes no sense. Make it 25 through all those crossroads and then back up to 55. That's just dumb. Dude, you are brave taking out an IROC Z in this weather. Holy crap. Holy shit, he almost lost control. Did you see that? I'm gonna get around him because I think he's drunk. And him too. Oh, we are getting close now. Yes, it is just around this corner. Got a red light. Oh, dang. And we're off. Oh, holy shit, don't hit that car. I just barely noticed him. Oh, be careful. All right. Where do you want the trailer, pray tell? Right there, I should have came in the other way. I could back it in, but I'm not going to. I can do that, but I don't wanna. They need it here by that tank to fill it up, you see. That's why I'm parking here. Give me five stars. Give me five stars. Boom. Just like that, we done. All right. Let's unhook this thing. Lower the landing gear. Boom. Red cable. What the eh? Green cable. The power. Step down, unlock, and we have successfully delivered your Alpine, no, LPG. That is large propane gas. Madam, delivery for you. Why do I only get four and a half stars? There was no damage. I'm on time. Good Lord. Anyway, thank you for joining me on this 1,000 mile journey to the south of Alaska. I had fun, I hope you did too. And I will see you in the next video. Now I'm gonna rob this store, so don't mind me. Give me your money!